I'm sure it's a very fluid situation, but what what's your personal end game for this? Like I know you mentioned uh wanting to face John Cena, but other than that, what is your overall goal for this to do the absolute best that I can? Mm. This is simple as that. Like this is one thing that I've learned from working with great people in the industry is that all you can do is do your absolute best. Control what you can control and do your absolute best. And that's all I'm going to do. Anytime I'm presented with an opportunity, I'm just going to give it my absolute best that I possibly can. And I've noticed that by having that attitude, great things have been happening, you know? Um, and yeah, I've just been very open to going in the direction the wind's taken me. You know, I didn't expect to have such great chemistry with Trick. You know, we kind of wrestled and had some fun in the ring after the match. And then we shot like a promo afterwards that mm -hmm. I think the, the fans have really reacted well to. And I think they're kind of seeing, <laughs> you know, I don't think there were any plans necessarily to have us as like a duo, but I think people are quite enjoying the, the kind of odd couple team mm -hmm. of, of me and Trick Williams. So I'm kind of, you know, I enjoyed that too. So I actually don't know what direction, if any direction things are going to go in. I think the fans would like to see more, but I guess you just have to keep tuning in to both TNA and NXT to see. Mm -hmm. I, I'll just say this. You've told the story before, but you, you basically booked yourself into a match with Kurt Angle before. So I think if anybody's going to maybe call their own shot or speak things in, into existence, I trust that you're the guy to do it. So I'll, I'll just I leave appreciate it at that. that. 